Hey, how you doing guys? Market uh, down because the IMF downgraded the uh, world economy by 40% over the next 18 months or so. Looks like Joe Biden is uh, ahead in the polls and starting to get the market's attention. A little more virus. States uh, in America starting to mandatory uh, quarantines on people from other states. We have countries like Vietnam saying they're not in any rush to open their borders. Same with Thailand. Same with numerous countries, and the question, buy or fly, what that means is what do you do? The short answer is we don't have to do anything because we should be all set up. If you've been listening to me, we have 25% in cash, 75% in stocks. The 75% works for us on the way up, the 25% on the way down. Look at this chart here. You see up the upper right there that that little bit is today. It has a long way to go before it uh, retests the old low, if that's what happens. And quite frankly, all this stuff going on uh, doesn't look like a big down day necessarily today, but it may get a little scary, which is why I'm making this video, is just relax. You know, we, we set ourselves up with the very best stocks to bounce back that work well in COVID, well not in COVID, and we have 25% that's going to work for us fantastically if it takes a big dive down. Now this next chart here is going to zoom in a little bit and I want you to look at the bottom where the RSI is and you can see at the beginning of the chart it's about 74 and if you follow the bottom part of the chart over to the right you'll see when it hits 74 again that's where I said to go ahead and make sure you had 25 percent in cash because we're in a very tenuous market. We don't know what's going to happen. This is not the market to be 100% invested in, and we may find out exactly why uh, here over the next couple of weeks. Now, this next chart, you can look at that black line there. If you look down at the bottom where the RSI is, you see how low it is. But if you go up top to where the NASDAQ line is, it was less than a third of the way to the bottom. The point here is that this is where people jump the gun, where I made the video that they weren't looking at the facts and evidence. They were looking at the pseudoscience chart instead, and they got tricked. Okay, so I hope you guys have your 25%. If not, um, you know, next time try to do a better job of having cash at the top. And we're going to be very careful when we go back in, because we're not going to get tricked by pseudoscience indicators. We're going to look at the facts and evidence, you know, have things markedly improved or have they not. But now is not the time to buy. Now is the time to sit back and see how this plays out. This could be very, very dangerous. Uh, and if you end up being, you buy today and you end up being 100% invested and this whole thing turns around uh, and the dead cat bounce doesn't work out for you, you could be in some serious trouble as opposed to, to having the 25% in cash. So the answer to the question on the video, uh, buy or fly, is we're gonna we're not doing either. We're gonna stand pat because we have stocks that are gonna bounce back very quickly, stocks that may even do halfway decently uh, in a really bad uh, resurgence of the COVID. And we have plenty of cash to take care of ourselves if this really goes south. So there's no need to get greedy and rush in by today. And there's no need to run for the exits either. If Remember I, in one of the first videos I made, if you run for the exit, you won't know when to get back in. You can watch Patrick Whelan's video where he kind of sitting around crying in his beer that he missed the huge run up from the bottom there because he sold everything. He's both a day trader and a long term investor. And if you get out completely, it's almost impossible to know when to get back in until it's pretty much too late. So we're going to start concentrating on that 25% in cash, watch it grow, look for market opportunities as we go along. But to be perfectly honest with you, part of the reason I made this video is I am going to start using video editors, buying a new camera. Uh, you should see a whole new look to my channel here coming up. So anyway, don't panic. Everything will be fine. I love you guys. Uh, please subscribe if you haven't subscribed. And I will probably make a video uh, talking, you know, combining all of the videos previously so people don't have to watch 10 different videos 
uh, to get the gist of what we've been been talking about. But things have dramatically changed for us. We no longer really care about the 75% of our portfolio. What we care about now is how we are going to strike while the iron's hot with our 25% in cash, right? These are titles to my videos, these little phrases I use, in case you guys have uh, rem forgotten, remind yourself, you know, we're we want to strike while the iron's hot, we don't want to jump the gun, all these things we've been talking about in the past are going to come to fruition. We're playing both sides against the middle, we're not playing the side with the 75% anymore, looks like we're going to start playing with the side with the 25%. So, please like, subscribe, share, love you guys, see ya.